good afternoon to Mbak Iju. Yeah, hi. <laughs> and right now we are going to have kind of interview session with Mbak Iju. So please introduce about yourself. Well, firstly, my name is Iju, Iju Setiawati, and I am from Indonesia, of course. <laughs> and uh, I did my undergraduate study in Brawijaya University. In, I started in 2007, and I was graduated in 2012. And then I directly continue my master's study in NCU. And I spent two years. I was graduated in 2014, and after that, I continue my PhD here as well in NCU, and I'm still doing it, <laughs> which is this is my fourth year anyway. So yeah, that's about myself. Okay, so may I ask you about why you decide to continue to pursue your higher degree even to the PhD, and you do it directly without any kind of the gap within the years, mm -hmm. so you just directly, what make you to decide these kind of things? Well, first of all, um, I will be getting old, right? So <laughs> since I was young, I kind of, uh, and I'm still have a lot of energy and a lot of time to do research. So I kind of just decide why not doing now instead of uh, pending it and doing it later. So that's all the same right so yeah I think uh, while we are still young just pursue your uh, what what you want to do even if it is work or it is studies so just pursue that uh, sooner okay. so that's why uh, that's what made me decide that because I like to study and I like to do the research and here in NCU the facility and the computer resources is uh, much better than our country. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, I kind of just why not doing now instead of doing it later? Basically, they are the same. Now is the sooner the better. <laughs> yeah. Okay. And then maybe the next question is: What is the benefit that you have got? while you study in Taiwan? How about the language barrier or how about the cultural shock that you have experienced during um, almost six years, right? Uh, five. Yes. Uh, the upcoming six years. Well, uh, about the cultural shock, of course you will experience it since the, 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 the culture here and in our country is totally different. So, first, uh, I kind of experience the cultural shock about six months so at that time I really not comfortable to live here because first of all we are Muslim and there is uh, some difficulty to find a halal food uh, uh, but uh, for the facility and transportation for example in Taiwan itself is much better than, than our country so that's that's one of the <laughs> plus uh, point that we can get in here. And then the uh, study environment in here is really uh, conducive. So you can say that you can study comfortable here. And about the language barrier, I don't think there is any language barrier because all the professors here, they speak English uh, better, good. So, uh, but <laughs> in some of the courses that I experienced, uh, just a few of the uh, teacher or a lecturer here, they, uh, some of them not really good in delivering their uh, courses in the class. But you can solve it by directly approach him if you have any problem or her, just ask some question and I think uh, it, they, 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 they will uh, explain better if they're doing it face to face with you if you are finding those problem but mostly the professor are good in class actually and uh, for the supervisor in research they are excellent 
they kind of guide us uh, a lot in doing our research and they also give us a freedom to choose what kind of topic that we want to do in our research and what kind of uh, method that we want to use they, they don't limit our choices so we can choose freely and yeah they are good <laughs> all the professors are good here basically so yeah that's about the research and Okay. Maybe this is the last question I want to ask you about. You mentioned about the halal food or something like that because yes. we consider about the Muslim students. So, may I ask you how can you survive? I mean, how can you adapt with this kind of environment? Mm -hmm. And finally, I can have the idea that you already really, really like Taiwan to study, right? Yes. So, what's the reason? How can you do that? Oh, about the about the food. How are you gonna solve this problem? First, uh, at that time, I just cook every day, but and then uh, in the upcoming next year, you kind of getting uh, busier than before. So uh, there are actually some vegetarian food that we can eat near uh, campus, and well, you still can cook anyway, just not every day. I think. Uh, it's uh, depend on person to person so <laughs> either you can cook or you just buy the vegetarian just uh, if you stay here longer you can enjoy it anyway you can get used to it so yeah and sorry about the second question about I mean the environment I mean about I maybe really the get used to Taiwan uh, and also about the people maybe because we are kind of the m minor yeah minor people in here then mm -hmm. How do you think about that? The, the, I mean, Taiwanese don't really judge uh, our race, you know, so it doesn't matter as uh, even though we are minority here, they don't really care. They just, uh, they don't really ignore you, actually. They, they are nice if you need any help. Uh, Taiwanese really nice. They will help you directly and they won't judge you just don't worry about the race they, 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 they don't care just enjoy yourself here <laughs> yeah okay no no pressure no nothing <laughs> 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 just uh, overall this is comfortable here no people judge you and it's safe it's pretty safe if you are wandering during the night or in the middle of the night or in in the early morning People want, uh, no one will disturb you or, yeah, it's really safe. Okay. So that's uh, the most uh, important thing in here that the neighborhood is really safe everywhere. So, yeah. Good. So maybe can you give your final statement to close this kind of this guy, no, the interview? Uh, okay, so yeah, if you want to go to Taiwan for, to pursue your high, higher degree in education I will welcome you and I will tell you that you will have a good life here and a good education here and a good experience in research so yeah please come to NCU <laughs> <laughs> not NCU uh, especially you can come to Taiwan uh, I mean the whole Taiwan there are a lot of university you can choose which uh, university that you want to do research and with professor that you want uh, to collaborate with your research with so yeah welcome to Taiwan <laughs> okay thank you Mai Chu okay welcome <laughs> could you tell us about your research study okay so uh, this is my fourth year for BSG degree so basically I have my own project which is on the uh, magnetic property the studying of magnetic properties in carbon uh, fullerene cluster that is a starting from the small fullerene cluster carbon 20 to carbon 60 you know buckyball fullerene right oh, yes yeah. so, so that's but uh, right now what I'm doing is I am kind of uh, studying the electronic structure of the transition metal dicalcogenides uh, which is 2D material so yeah you can see here some uh, the result that I got so this is the 2D material that I am studying which is uh, there are the two 
edge and on this structure here yeah, and so on and so on so I kind of studied the electronic structure which is calculating the pen structure uh, in order to uh, decide whether the uh, the material is semiconductor or metallic so I calculate the band structure uh, the the band gap and there are mole uh, molybdenum disulfide hafnium diselenide and platinum diselenide and also platinum disulfide and uh, apart from that I also do another project which is uh, collaborate with Japanese uh, and we use their code that's called Tombo and yeah I cannot show you the uh, band structure result here because I haven't got it but we do the calculations here using the all electron method which is using their code to calculate uh, the electronic properties of the uh, carbon cluster and also fuller and cluster, uh, fuller like cluster and also I try the uh, magnetic properties for transition metal decalcogenides decal as well so yeah that's all for my result Okay. okay, thank you.